Now we all know I haven't made a video on Project Nita Mouse, so, well, you know, that's really because there's nothing really on it. Now, I actually found something on it, so that's why this video is what it is today. Now, on the Sega website, there's a Sega blog um, posted by the Sega people or representatives or whoever. Uh, actually happened this week I missed some of it but the second part I actually entered now the first part was well there's like this challenge that they give the fans and they uh they let you choose like what characters would you like to see in Project Needle Mouse now for me that's pretty awesome I mean it really is now they let you choose from characters like Chip, Amy, Shadow Vector, Charmy, um, and some new guy that is like Sonic's friend, Mr. Neo Mouse. Uh, so I was wondering, like, what? And uh, other stuff like that. Most of the characters. But, and they let you, like, answer questions, and, like, you can cross off which one you don't want. And each one was crossed off one by one, and I would actually like to see Chip in that game or tails or something like that but it actually turned out the results are nobody's gonna be in the game except Sonic well I don't know about in the game but playable characters is only gonna be Sonic so uh... I, that's good in some ways but I mean cause in Sonic 1 you get to play Sonic, Sonic 2 you get to play as Sonic and Tails Sonic 3 you get to play as Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles, and then Sonic 4, I'm thinking they should put like four playable characters in there, because four, Sonic 4, it only makes sense. Now, uh, they have a new challenge, like a second challenge, where they actually like ask you, as fans, which badniks do you want in there? Now, for those of you who don't know, badniks are the enemies in the old Sonic games like let's say the grabber now the grabber is actually one of my favorite batniks because he's not annoying because he's actually not that hard to get captured by I mean not oh you get what I mean you shouldn't be getting captured by him is what I'm trying to say uh, if you do then you like like playing around with him like I used to do I just used to go up to him like he used to grab me because it's just just fun <laughs> and Tails comes out of nowhere and helps me now um, that's the challenge they're telling us to basically draw pictures put them on photo bucket and link it to their page or send it to a guy from Sega which I did already and uh, my picture as you see it's pretty awesome uh, I drew it it was actually pretty hard to do all that uh, painting stuff on Photo Bucket, but I did the Sonic that I drew. It looks pretty awesome, I think. Uh, so yeah, basically all the classic badniks that you know you want in there. They actually have two that's already going to be in there. The bug on the wheel from Sonic 2, he's going to be in there. Uh, the the praying mancer from Sonic 2 that throws his claws at you he's gonna be in there and he was drawn by a kid which I think looks really good and all these other kids drew these other badniks which they actually look like they didn't they weren't like hand drawn only like one kid I seen looks like it was hand drawn but the other guys look like they just took it off and like did something with it I have no idea but uh, and if we do all that and they get a hundred pictures, they're going to give us the name of the game. They're going to give us basically information about the game. And, you know, that's really exciting. I mean, 
I'm glad Sega's giving us a chance to actually participate in the game and actually make it like a fan game. So I thought it'd be pretty cool to enter the grabber. And uh, so if you guys see a grabber in Sonic 4 or whatever they call it, you'll know that's me. <laughs> so that's going to be pretty honoring if they do it. So uh, is it going to be for the ring edge? I'm, I'm hoping, I'm still really hoping that it is, but uh, they said they're going to give us some information on the needle mouse thing in February. So can't wait for that. Uh, I'm really starting to really believe the ring edge thing now, and I'm kind of not, but I'm more on the leaving side right now. Uh, because they're honoring the Dreamcast's 10th anniversary, which I don't think they ever did before, and it's just funny how they do it this year when they're supposedly rumored to come up with a new console. That's pretty funny. So, yeah, I'm Mr. Sonic Thunder, and subscribe and participate in the um, Batnik uh, creation contest to get your Batnik in the game. And see ya.